I was going to say five yeah. or six years ago, Leon Edwards, I, I believe, came to train two, for, two for, camps. for two Usman. Camps. Yeah. And one yeah. of them was for his fight against Usman. I was going to yeah. ask you, um, the fighter he was five or six years ago and the fighter he is now, uh, how do you feel like he's improved? Because as maybe I'm being Nine biased. day. Nine day. Yeah. Nine day. He was a guy that really didn't understand wrestling, couldn't defend wrestling. And being one month here wasn't going to give him enough time. He had to do it at home. You know, and he knew by being here that he didn't need to go anywhere. You have it all there. And he brought it all there. Look, the proof is in the pudding. His last performance have been fantastic. But, you know, I think that he, he should get a title shot after, personally. You know, they may make him fight one more time, but I think Leon's done enough to, to, to warrant uh, a, the, the, a next title shot after, after Burns. You know, but we'll see. But, you know, the way it goes, right? You have a fight, and all of a sudden these guys throw the great fight, and you go, oh, okay. Because before Burns did what he did, Leon was the front runner, but then Burns goes and does what he does. Man, it's like this is you gotta understand. People don't understand. This is a money business. So guess what? Whoever's gonna get eyeballs to open and get your pocketbook out and spend the money, that's who's got the driver's seat. You know, not often do you see uh, a, a guy that doesn't sell very much get opportunities. Okay, you do see it, but not often. It's usually the person that gets big opportunities is going to sell 